Now to install Windows 10 if you're not within the first wave of updates. Microsoft are doing this, uh, they're distributing the updates in waves to save bandwidth from their servers. You need to go to this directory here. Um, so C, Windows, Software Distribution, Download. Uh, you need to then highlight that, make this whole folder empty, delete everything in there. Um, by the way, make sure you're not currently installing updates. I am. Ignore that for a moment. Um, just make sure you're not installing any updates whatsoever. And Windows Updates is just currently sat there saying how many updates you have to do. Um, so, you you know, where it usually says here like 16 important updates, blah, 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 10 optional updates. Leave it at that. Don't do anything. Make that folder completely empty and then open CMD and run it as administrator. Put that command line in, don't enter it, whatever you do, just put it in like that. And then you need to click check for updates. Once you've clicked check for updates, open your command prompt with that and hit enter. Somehow, in this magical stuff, um, it tricks Windows into thinking that um, it's, well, it needs to install Windows 10. It's doing it now. I'm not within the first wave of the um, update, so, and this is, well, this is the first day it's been out, so. Empty directory, open Windows updates, uh, type that in the command prompt, but don't enter. Click check for updates. As soon as you've done that, hit enter on that. But do it after you've clicked check for updates. Uh, hit enter on this and then that's it. You'll see this pop up saying downloading Windows, preparing for installation. Sit back, relax, voila.